Hey guys, this is Raven Extreme here. Welcome back to Let's Play Brave Pizza Musashi. Let's do it! Let's go ahead and get back into this. Alright, so we last left off at the end of uh, chapter one, now we're moving into uh, chapter two. Musashi, thou hath awakeneth. Hey, geezer, wait, have we met? <clears throat> I'm Livers, the butler. Who cares about that? Why am I here? We foundeth thou sleeping, after thou defeated Thirst Quencher's abominable robotic. So we brought <laughs> thou to hither roometh. Hmm. Oh, yeah, and that big imbecile with the cape. He kidnapped a princess. Loser, I let him get away. Hey, Geezer, do I have to save the princess to go back to my world? Thou art beeth corrected. However, they willeth not sitteth around quietly. They willeth come hither for Lumina. Something special about Lumina? Indeedeth. Legendary brave fencer Musashi Damn. is Lumina, the sword of luminescence. To sealeth away the wizard of darkness. Darkness. And when it absorbs all the five scrolls, earth, water, fire, wind, and sky, thou doth will inheriteth extraordinary power. Why couldn't it have been heart? <laughs> the sword of luminescence, Lumina and the five scrolls. No wonder they want them. So where can I get my hands on the five scrolls? <clears throat> If only our fortune teller, Sia Beaverly, were here, she would know. She ran off with some handsome dude, huh? <laughs> no, she was kidnapped. What? So the princess is not the only one? Well, actually, there were 40 people at All You Can Eat Palace. Now there are only All You Can five Eat Palace, left. yes. <laughs> They've all been sealed within Bincho Fields and scattered in all directions. Bincho Fields? What are they? Are they the Thirst Quencher Empire's doing? Yes, I saw it myself. Everyone was sealed into large green diamonds and then just poof, vanished. I can't believe it. So I guess one of them was the fortune teller, right? So that means I have to save not only the princess, but everyone else, too. Sir Musashi, I knew that thou would help with us. Thou mayest break. Bincho feels easily with Lumina. Oh, and these will help thou. Get the Bincho watch, or the rescue list to find out who I get. Should also get the Bincho watch. Yep, there we go. I'll explain the Bincho, uh, the, the sensor watch in a little when bit. If that watch flashes red, a Bincho field doth nearby. The people whom you say will help you on your journey. Good luck, Sir Musashi. Grillen Village is located at the foot of this castle. Please use it as your base. Before thou goest, thou should do some research in the castle's library. You I'll may go as well books, yeah, so you may as well go see Spike Shinky. Sir Musashi. I forgot to <clears> mention, <throat> but this room is yours, so use it as you wish. Please take care on your journey, sir. Now give me some tea, bitch. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, Sir Musashi, been waiting for you. Oh. Who are you? I'm Scribe Shanky. Well, you see, my job for now is to read these books for you. Come closer. Oh god, bad touch. Bad touch! You don't necessarily have to read the books. They <clears throat> they give you information based on, you know, history. You don't necessarily have to do it. Oh, was that enough? Yep, there. Well then, you should go down to the village. Well, let's see. It's a shame that the gondola is broken. 
I know. Use both of your big swords. Lumina and fusion? Oh, yes. You can go along the gondola's ropeway and glide down to the village. Ninja style, baby. This palace must be pretty high up on the mountain. I'll take your advice. Thanks. Alright, now we get a... Think... Oh, right. Alright, so, when you're at the castle, you have a choice to visit, uh, the people you saved, go to see Scribe Shanky, uh, go back to your room, the sub-menu is your own menu, and you go down to the village. That's basically your choices for now. There's one more option that opens up a little later on, but, uh, I don't believe that's until chapter 3 or chapter 4, so let's go ahead and head to the village. <clears throat> Badass scene coming. <clears throat> Excuse me. Look, it's Arnold. But first, I'm kind of hungry. Better eat before I starve. Come to think of it, I haven't had anything since. Uh, I better get some grub first. Alright, so. Alright, so he can't let you pass yet until the mayor, sa until the mayor says something. Alright, so what you want to do is just take this path down here. Let me do something real quick here. Go to config. Oh, right. Um, you also have experience stats, which um, the more you use certain things, the more damage or the more defense you, uh, you, you have there. So let me explain each piece. Um, we should also use body, um, the more your body is, the more defense you have. The more, uh, the more mind you, the more mind you have, the more defense, uh, <clears throat> sorry. The more for your body, <clears throat> sorry, man, whew, god, this cold's killing me. Um, body, the higher your body is, the higher your physical damage will be, um, with fusion. Uh, mind, the more mind you have, and that increases while you travel, it'll, uh, be, you know, damage reduction. Fusion, um, Fusion's, of course, fusion attack power, and Lumina is Lumina's attack power, so it's very self-explanatory. You also have items that you can use, um, legendary armor, which you come across later, you learn techniques from certain people, and then you can config. Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and head down. Alright, so the first, first, uh, objective here is to... I don't want to walk, I want to, alright, define the inn. Okay, there we go. That's, that, that's actually the place you're looking for, the uh, bread shop. So what you want to do is buy, um, the food here will allow you to increase your BP, uh, your BP. Now, if you buy, um, the milk, the milk can spoil. You also, notice at the bottom of the screen, have a, uh, tire percentage. Um, once it starts getting up high, your damage becomes, you know, your damage gets weaker. Uh, once it hits 100%, you automatically fall asleep and, uh, have to recover from that. So I'm gonna buy a couple rye breads. Three of them, actually. Alright, let's go ahead and take off here. Alright, here's the uh, appraisal shop, which uh, isn't normally open this early. There's the inn. Toys, toys, toys. Uh, that's something for later. I'll explain that one later. Uh... Welcome! Haven't seen you before. I'm Usashi. I'll be hanging around this town for a while. 
Is that so? Have you met my son, Tim? And what do you need? Alright, here where you actually get your HP stuff. So you'll buy, you know, gels, uh, gels for HP, C drink restores your HP and a little bit of BP. Um, your S revive is, is your revival item. Uh, mints will actually wake you, uh, you know, repair your tired by half and gets you some, uh, BP back. Antidote, of course, recruits poison. Cheese. You want to buy at least one or two cheeses and let them sit there. Don't use them for a long time. Because at the more the more you have it in your inventory, the longer it is, the more HP and BP you recover. Um, I'm gonna have to go ahead and end the episode here real quick, guys. So when we come back, we'll go ahead and keep going with uh, Brave Prince of Musashi. So see you guys later. Bye.